Hi everyone, my name is Lori Fulgreen, and today I wanted to um, show you my pedigree chart I have on Ancestry.com. And you first start with yourself and go to your parents, and this is your grandparents, and your great-grandparents, this whole line that I have. And today I wanted to talk about my great-grandfather, Captain Byard Fish Folk. He was a sea captain and a artist. He did um, many oil paintings of ships. And I actually have one that he had done for my father when he graduated from high school. So I have that and a lot of other um, paintings are on the internet on eBay. You can see a lot of them. So my um, cousins and sisters have purchased um, some of his paintings, which is really neat. So I have some to show you, but with this, I wanted to um, show you the chart that you could build um, on your own. And this, I'll start with him, Bayard Fish Folk. So there's all um, some information here that you see, and I've been um, researching um, this General Slocum disaster, which happened in 1904. And over a thousand people were killed. It was it was for a, a church um, church picnic, and it caught on fire. And there's all families and everything who perished. And my great grandfather had rescued um, people from that. And I have his um, certificate that he had. I have, a, I have it framed here. So. Actually, right here, 1904, and um, so I have all his information, his um, date of birth, where he was born, um, and where he was, where he died. So if we click here, and I can show you all um, the information that I had, um, you know, pulled from Ancestry, different census records, um, his military. Um, things too. So here's a picture of him here. And these are all the census records where I found him. And in 19 or 1900, he was an artist. And in the um, New York state license, he was uh, census, he was a pilot. And then through just an inspector of ship holes and merchant mariner. So um, I can show you in the gallery some of his photographs through the years and his oil paintings. So you can see just how many I was able to find and pull into Ancestry.com. So there's some really neat ones. This is the one I have right here. I can show you. Load. Sorry, my internet is slow. So that's the one I have. It would be better if we go this way. And he's probably about 40, and that's much older. And that's our family crest. Here he is sitting on an alligator. Here he is at the beach. And this one my uncle had, he, I think I gave him all his grandsons uh, a painting for their graduations. He would sign them. And on the back, he would give a lot of information about the ship itself. So I just wanted to share that with you today. And maybe next time, um, show you more on the pedigree chart. All right. Thanks. And take care.